Top 15 Essential Linux Commands 1. PWD, Print Working Directory This is a very useful command that displays the full path to the current directory and lets you know where you are. 2. sudo super do -er. This command provides an efficient way to temporarily grant users or user groups privileged access to system resources, so that they can run commands that they cannot run under their regular accounts. 3. Top. This command presents a dynamic view of the processes running on your system along with various system statistics such as CPU usage, memory consumption, etc. 4. LS command. The LS command is one of the more basic commands and is designed to list the names, permissions, and size of files and directories. 5. Churn command. The churn command changes user ownership of a file, directory, or link in Linux. Every file is associated with an owning user or group. It is critical to configure file and folder permissions properly. 6. CAT The CAT command is a utility command in Linux and stands for concatenate. One of its most common usages is to print the content of a file onto the screen, without you having to enter the file. 7. Clear. The clear command clears your screen, if you need to. Pretty simple. 8. History command. The history command in Linux is a built-in tool that displays a list of commands used previously in the terminal session. 9. W command. The W command provides a quick summary of every user logged into a computer, what each user is currently doing, and what load all the activity is imposing on the computer itself. 10. CD. Change directory. This command literally says what it is and allows you to move from one directory to another if you know the location. 11. Free minus H. The free command is a Linux command that allows you to check for memory usage on your system, or to check the memory statistics of the Linux operating system. 12. LSBLK command. The LSBLK stands for List Block Devices, and as the name suggests, it is used to list out all block devices in a tree-like format. You can gather comprehensive information about each device connected to your Linux system including the disk partitions and their respective sizes. 13. VMStat command. Virtual memory statistics, also known as VMStat, reports various bits of system information. Things like memory, paging, processes, I.O., CPU, and disk scheduling are all included in the array of information. 14. GREP command. GREP is short for Global Regular Expression Print and used for searching and matching text patterns in files or processes contained in the expression. Here it is being used to find the Firefox processes from within the top command. 15. Add user command. The add user command in Linux creates a new user or group. Here I am creating a user called Dave, and adding any further details for Dave is optional. 15. for creating another easy to understand video. We hope you found this interesting and useful, so please like and subscribe. See you again soon.